need anything? Need What's something. happening? All right, I see how it is. See you around. Can I help you? I'm uh, just having a look. Hey, man. Oh. Hey, How's hold on. Looks like you've got a few ears here. Deke, you there? Boozer, why the hell aren't you in your damn bunk? Sleep. Remember what I said back in the tunnel? Don't go up there, Dick. It's it's making you crazy. Boozer, I okay. Look, I go up there because there's freaks up there. I kill them here. I kill them there. Bounties are all the same to me. Then what are the tulips for, huh? I saw them, Dick. Here on the table this morning. <laughs> the same one she had at the wedding. I remember. I'm looking up. Listen, Boozer, get some rest. I gotta go. Deacon out. And then the tulips, Boozer, they're stone crop. Get it right. That should be it. That's right. I gotta finish burning out this infestation zone. I smell it. <clears throat> gotta be getting close. Another one. Yeah, time to light it up.
on. Stop by the hot springs when you're here. Doctor, I hear you. St. John out. Boundaries.
St. John, this is Tucker. Like I said before, I haven't seen Boozer's sweet face around these last few days. You sure he's all right? This is Deacon. Boozer's fine. Like I said, he's just been busy. Doing runs for that son of a bitch, Mark Copeland, no doubt. I get the feeling he doesn't like it much. Boozer, I mean. Like I said, I ain't his old lady. Deacon out. I learn something new every day. Something under this. Open up, don't got all day. Open the gate. It's that rifter. Yeah, I know him. Yeah. 
That should be it. Hey, what do you need? What do you want? Deke, you ever ride with a drifter, scars all over his face, carries a tire iron, goes by the name of Limbo? Don't know him. He came into camp yesterday to turn in some bounties, have a few drinks. Seems like he didn't leave until early this morning. Well, Tuck, I don't run security here, so why don't you just tell Alki about that? He beat a man, Deke, and a woman, to death, Bowman and Hewitt. Her face was so smashed in, you couldn't tell it was her. Hewitt, oh, Maria, right? Jesus. This asshole, Limbo, he's a local. Alki says they've set up shop at the old Forest Service Watchtower on the east slope of Three Finger Jack. Yep, I know where it is, and, uh, I'll handle it. I thought you might.
need this more than you. Hey, Tuck, I'm here, and yeah, looks like Limbo and his crew are calling the place home like nothing ever happened. You said his face was scarred, so, uh, I mean, more, please? What else can you tell me? He wears a green coat. Looks like a goddamn leprechaun. That tower. You bring me his tire iron, Deacon St. John, and I want it covered in what's left of the son of a bitch's face. Now you hear you. Uh, St. John out. Holy shit! Finally, Jesus. It was here. Fire! Fire! Oh, Look out to your side. Here you go. Bike bomb. Throw it. Still got old iron tooth on you, yeah?
damn it! Get him! Open fire! Gotta reload! Sniper on the road. Oh, God damn it. everything.
Jealous ambusher, yeah? Damn rippers. Renegade Patrol, god damn it. Stabbing him in the back, huh? That right? Like this.
That's worth checking out. Son of a bitch, where are you going, Don't huh? Go! Don't go! No. You will die. That's the last of them. Uh, guess your days of setting ambushes around here are over. All right, where did you hide your bunker, huh? I know you got one. I have you. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. It's the Wild West again. And some men are acting like law and order are a thing of the past. But, last I checked, this is still the United States of America. And in America, the right of property shall not be infringed. We have the right to claim territory, to hold it, and to defend it. Sure, we took this land from the Indians, no point in rewriting history, but we took it by force. And force is the only thing that will move us now. We're not gonna roll over for a bunch of bullies. If the feds, or rippers, or marauders think they're gonna come rolling into my wilderness, they got another thing coming.
strongest survive. The strongest take, and the strongest will succeed. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. That's not the Cope Law and Order or a thing of the past. What are you talking about? But yeah, you got a point about force being the only thing that... Open up. I've seen him around. How's it going? What do you want? You find that son of a bitch? Yeah, here's old Iron Tooth, just like you asked. Ah, nice work. Deke, you're always the one person I could count on to get things done. <laughs> you know. I have no idea where you and Boozer rode off to. 
But it's good to see you. Well, we're around, Tuck. And if you need anything, you know how to reach me. Go see Alki. I'll update your credits. Yeah? Uh, it doesn't look too bad. Oh, Wait going? a sec, I got it. Looks like you've got a few ears here. Yeah. Close to a nest. Whew, I can smell it. That's the last of them. Build your damn nest somewhere else, you damn freaks. Yeah. <laughs> 
hate this. That's it. Hey, babe. Yeah, I, I cleaned him out. They won't be bothering you no more. Uh, hey, me again. Did I even tell you something? Hey, it's okay, it's just my But you told me that we shouldn't come back, and I didn't listen to you, and then I knew that it was getting worse, but I... None of us knew it was going to be like this. It was fast. You don't understand. I don't know what I would do if I lost you. This is my fault. Hey. Don't lose a name. I made a promise. Remember? 
can wait. Sarah, come on. There's a kid here. Wait. Hey. Oh, hey, are you okay? <laughs> come on, we gotta find your parents, okay? Here we go. Come on. Ah! Oh, Stabbed me. Oh, yeah. Uh. Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't think it's that bad. Okay, what? Okay. Just hold this here as near as you can. Uh -huh. I don't know. I think I can walk. Okay, good enough. What was that? Okay. Two hours ago, this place was calling the feds. Yeah, they must have evacuated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They must have bugged the hell out. She's burning up. The uh, knife must have nicked her kidney or something. She's turning sick. Mm. How you doing, mm. little sister? So stupid. It's this little, this little kid. This, this goddamn little kid. Big goddamn knife. Hey, help me. Mm. Mm. Oh, oh, shit. Mm. Oh, no. You want to be able to come through? We gotta get to the roof. Flag down one of those choppers. Mm. See if you can rest over here. Hey, mm -hmm. easy, easy. <sighs> she reminded me so much of my little sister, you know. Mm. So we used to play that hide and seek game all the time. And she would just, just uh, hide her head in her coat just like that. Mm. I've been cutting my name, but nothing like that. She's burning up. Jesus. Okay. We gotta move. We gotta go that way. Ah. Come on. All right. Hey, sweetheart, can you move? Oh, sir. Yeah, I got her. Go find this way out. It's nothing, it's nothing, Coco. I got this, go! Hold on, don't shoot! Just fuck you! Oh. Yeah, we see you got guns, goddammit. Stop shooting! Sir? Hey, 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 I'm unarmed. I'm unarmed. Get out! Now listen to me, listen to me. My girl's out there, she's been stabbed. We're just trying to get to the roof. Get out there's a helicopter right now. So listen. You killed just... my wife! Oh, no, no, no. Look, I didn't know anything about your wife being killed. I'm sorry, sir. No, sir. Dude, you didn't do it. You didn't do it. Okay, listen. Just, you just, killed my wife. You killed my wife. My wife. God. You killed her. Stop. 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 Wait, we need help. She's been wounded. What's wrong with her? Well, she's not. Whatever the hell's going on out there, she's been stabbed. I can't take anymore. Oh, okay, listen, O'Brien. If we don't get her to a hospital, she's going to die. There are no more hospitals. Oh, come on, no more hospitals. You got uh, doctors, you got triage, you got a mass unit. Oh, look, I'm just a grad student, okay? I, I got volunteered for this. I'm not even supposed to be out here. O'Brien. Okay. I've only got room for two of you, okay? Two. We only got room for two of you. We're over. Wait, okay? I can only take two of you. Two. <laughs> Come on, help me. Come on. All right, sweetheart. It's okay. You're gonna be all right. I got her. I'm gonna be right back. <laughs> okay, Boozer. Let's go. We gotta hold get on, on that. Hold on. We gotta get on that shot. I heard what he said. There's only room for two on that chopper. Go. Go with her. I'll be okay. Look, I've been through worse shit than this before. You know? Here we go. <laughs> Look. 
Where are you going? What? Where? Where? Refugee camp, west of Three Finger Jack. No. Boozer, he's never gonna make it without me. You, uh, you rest easy, okay? I'll, uh, I'll be back to check on you, and uh, I know, yeah, you would want me to, but I guess Boozer's right. <laughs> I can't help myself. It's, uh, it's like I said, I'll be back. Boozer? Another Nero chopper. Wonder what the hell they're up to. and thieves and I can't let any of them escape. Just 
down. How many of you are left, huh? Someone's here. Good night. I saw something. Something's here. Men coming! What was that? Or something? <laughs> Damn it! I How do you like killing drifters? Is that it? How do you like it now? Thank <laughs> you. 
fuck is that? Rock. <laughs> One, gotta finish this. Is that it? Is that all you got? Yeah, that's what I thought. Next time you set up an ambush, don't pick on the wrong guy. I wonder if they had a bunker around here. I'll bet they do.
Here's the hatch, yeah. Knew you had one. Hey, this is handy. A map. All marked up, yeah, and that. Guess they won't be needing it <laughs> Not anymore.
Hold him! I'm hit! I'm hit! This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Many of you probably don't remember the Cold War. But living through it was a special kind of hell. Every time you heard a plane flying overhead, you'd think for sure that this is it. That's the one coming to drop the... safe in dark times was to go underground. We built my first bunker with him, but we couldn't build it out in the backyard. With a neighbor spying, we had to go out into the woods, ways from the road, where no one would happen upon it. With a bunker, you knew that if the country went to hell in a handbasket, with that man will cover, climb down the ladder and you'd be safe. haven't changed. Better to dig a bunker than an early grave. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Yeah, Cope? How'd that work out for the poor bastards who own the one that I just cleared out? Huh? Not so good, I'm guessing. Since they were all dead long before I ever got there. Not to. Look! I just leave it. All right, I'm just out hunting for each boozer. You got that? Bounties. That's the only reason that I go up there.
Hold on, hold on. They're slowing down. Looks like they're stopping. Get back here with that! Oh, shit, that's mine! Ah, oh, finally! Jesus Christ, those shits can run fast. So, what the hell are they doing? Looked like they were out here... Shit, wrangling freaks, I don't know. They had a newt and some kind of noose, like they were putting a tracking device on it or something. What? Wrangling? What do you mean? You know, like tying it up, taking samples from it or something, like those guys used to do on that wildlife show. Pretty fucked up. They got chased off by swarmers, bugged the hell out. They left some gear behind, a radio. Wait, you don't, you don't think that Sarah... No, no, not, I, I, I don't know. I'm just, I need 
He's alive, Boozer. He's alive. O'Brien. One of them. Nero. I'm gonna track him down. If I can, I, I'm gonna... I'm gonna get some answers. Damn it. Okay. Look, I'll be able to ride soon. I'll help you, Deke. If he's alive, we'll find the bastard. You're goddamn right. I'm gonna check in later. Deacon out. Okay, O'Brien. Where the hell are you? So I'm sort of lost. I was hoping you could help me out. I'm sorry, you're lost? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for the old Belknap Road and there's not a lot of signs around here. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Nope. What? What is it? What? Oh, it's <laughs> great. That is just perfect. <laughs> that, that is great. That is great. So about those directions? <laughs> I'm really sorry. I, I don't know where Belknap, Belknap, Belknee, Bel Belknap. Belknap, that's the one. And I don't know where it is. I really can't help you. I'm sorry. So no, then? <sighs> nope. Okay. Well, thanks anyway. Hey! Could you use a ride? Yes, I could. Thank you for finally offering. I'm Sarah. I'm Deacon. Oh, well, sorry about the mess. <clears throat> um, I don't know, how do I, uh, this contraption? Pretty much what you think, just throw your just... leg over, yeah. Okay, um, there. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> Ready. Hey! <laughs> hey! Hold on tight. Thank you so much. No problem. It's just, there are no bars out here, so... Well, sure there is. There's a place called Crazy Willie's up the road. There's, uh... No, I meant cell phone reception. I knew what you meant. Right, of course. Anyway. So what's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? <laughs> you know, I ask myself that all the time. I do research. Um, you know, I study things. Thanks. Had no idea what research was. Sorry, um, I do plants. You study plants? Yeah. That was close. Hey, you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just. Oh my god. Hey, hey, I've got cell phone reception. Hey, yeah, I'm fine. I just. The car you gave me, it's a real piece of shit. I need a tow. I'm on, um, I don't know, some. I don't know where I Road am. 42. Road 42? Yeah, I'm, I'm about a mile up. Okay, I'll see you when you get here. Come on, I'll take you back to your car. We can wait for the tow truck. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Well, all right. I'm sure when those boys come back, they'd be happy to give you a ride, so... <laughs> okay, all right. <clears throat> all right, I just... Just give me a second. Oh. Oh. 
They'll be any minute now. All right, so. all right, all right. Screw it. Let's go. Just drive a little careful this time, okay? <laughs> you weren't really lost, were you? Well, that all depends on who you ask. My ex would say I've been lost for years. Well, you certainly know your way around here. You're not from around here. No, I'm from Seattle. The company that I work for, they just, they opened this lab here, so... Here I came, to the middle of nowhere. To research plants. That's right, I already told you I forgot. Um, yeah, so, the company that I work for, they, they do work for this bioengineering firm, and, um, some of the plants that I, I look at are pretty rare, and they just happen to grow here. That has got to be the best thing I've ever heard. What the hell? Clay, we got company. All right, gentlemen. Smart now, huh? Out here, it's big bad dog. biker, huh? Yeah. Uh, yes, hit him again. Uh, you like that bike, boy? Come on, hit him. Not so tough now, him. are you? Uh, you don't learn, do you, Watch bike boy? Oh yes, yes. Oh, dude. I'll teach him good. Yeah, you like that? How about that? Shit. Yeah, I'm out. Roll, goddammit! Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. No, no, no. Uh, oh, my God. Hey. I'm so sorry. No, no, no. I, I don't even know. I just was looking in your bag, and no, it's I, I right. saw that, and I... Oh. oh, my God, I could have killed somebody. Well... Oh, shit. Yeah, but you, you gotta kind of aim it at them first. I've never done anything like that before. Hey, I saw, it's okay, it's okay. I They're saw going. it in They're your going. bag, and I just I tried to call you the police, good. but there were no You know what we're gonna no do? Bars. We're gonna, gonna do? no reception. I'm gonna wait right here until your guy comes. Okay. Thank you. I've never done anything like that. Huh. Could have fooled me. Yeah? Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Today, I was thinking about where it all began. Let's go deep. Back to the big WW2. 1947, the feds passed uh, what they call it the National Security Act. about one thing, Cope. All these Nero refugee camps, they did turn out to be death camps, just not the way you were expecting.
for the path. Show him the path. He shot me! Find cover! Better than nothing.
exhausted. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, now we're in business. All right, here we go. Hey, I'm here to relieve you. Quarter. Damn yeah, damn time. Injector. Jesus, I'm Let's tired. Let's see if this still works. Did I miss anything? Yeah, you wouldn't believe it. This morning, we had a goddamn pilgrimage come through. Uh, what? What are you talking about? <laughs> Half-naked, shaved heads. Some of them cut up pretty bad. Driving a whole convoy of hippy-dippy vans and trucks. Ah, oh, shit. I've seen these clowns. Were they chanting a bunch of shit like, Get low! Be free! Follow the path! Shit like that. Is it? God damn, this has got to be close. Here, cut! Finished. Should be less freaks around here.
небось. Son of a bitch, you radio me. Copeland out. on that. Not a fan of it myself, if you want to know the truth. Give Drifters a bad name. What if you'd shot Manny, you know? Who'd fix my bike then? Stupid piece of shit. <laughs> Screw you! You want to cope with Stonies? You little bitch! That's what you are! You little bitch! Nope, it's done. Uh, I got him. Uh, you tell Marked him. Marked on these coordinates and sent you in. Hey, Drifter. Yeah, he's alive. But I won't promise you how long he's gonna stay that way. Deacon out. Boozer, you there? I was just calling to check up on you. Yeah, Dean, come here. You hang in there, buddy. As soon as we get that arm patched up, we're riding north, just like you said. Ah, I hope so. God, I miss the open road. You just work on getting better. I still got some work to do on the bike, and we gotta stock up on some gear. But once you're patched up, we're out of here. Deacon out. Okay, this is it. Yeah, oh, this camp is gonna be crawling. 
Uh, yeah, nah, nah, you gotta leave the bike out here, Deke, or it'll pull all of them down on you. Oh, warehouse. Yeah, it looks like the kind of place you want to call home, yeah. What you all shit yourself at once? Jesus Christ. Oh, goddamn freaks. What the hell? Okay, one nest done. How many more you got? Okay, gotta be careful, gotta be careful.
Hello, squatter camp. Sons of bitches have been setting up ambushes around here, yeah? had trouble concentrating.
Move it up. Boys and girls, let's do this. Is that the last of them? Freaks on the mountain from now on. Hey, Deke. How'd it go? Were there, were there a lot of them? Nah, it wasn't too bad. That's why I wanted to take them on while it's dark out. Some of them were strong as hell, though. Yeah. Cold makes them stronger. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Boozer. I knew that. Anyway, well, thanks for... Thanks for doing that, Deke. Get some shut eye, Boozer. Deacon out. Tucker. Hot Springs Camp. You there? I'm gonna need more info on that survivor Larson spotted in Marion Forks. Deacon, I already told you everything I know. Young, a woman. Wait. You mentioned Hopper Jets. That old pancake house by the East Bridge. Lumberjack. Big stack of pancakes. Yeah, I know the one. Okay, I'll start there. You do that. And remember, bring her to me. A group of drifters came through the other day, traded us a few guns. Maybe something you could use. Yeah, keep that in mind. You can out. Murdering assholes can't let any of them get out of here alive. Here you are. Okay, here we go.
What was that? Ah. Drifters, you ambushed down there, huh? What's that? <gasps> Camp's clear. Now you know how it feels, being on the other end of it, yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see if they got an underground bunker around here.